Today I'm going to demonstrate the shutting down and the booting up of my Windows XP computer versus my new Windows Vista laptop. Here is my Windows XP computer that I got back in March of this year and it's a quad core processor. It's Acer. It's really neat. It's got a blue light and it's got a lot of essentials and it's a really good computer. I have a mouse as you can see and that's on my desk and I have a wireless keyboard right, right here on the pullout tray that I uh, that I use. The monitor and because it's close to Christmas holidays I put a cat theme on my monitor and I'm not sure if you can see exactly the cat theme. At the bottom we've got the usual clock and we've got a, quite a few icons at the bottom. Right now I've got my Outlook Express open which we will close like because we're going to reboot and we will close down Yahoo Messenger. We will actually sign out of it because I'm going to reboot. And we will close out of Windows Live Messenger. I decided to do, to do this to just show you the difference between my two computers. So what do I do to shut this one down is I click on the Start menu with my mouse and it pops up. And then I go to turn off computer. And then I go to where you'll see turn off. So we're going to turn off this computer and see how long it takes. And let's see what happens. Now I've got the screen coming up with this computer. I'll back away for it for a little bit. And the computer is off. Now, we're going to start up this computer. And you can see the type of motherboard that I have. And it shows Windows XP. So I have Windows XP home version running on this particular computer. Not sure if you can hear it, but I have a, happen to have a CD in so you can hear the fan start up as it's rebooting and so far we've only got a black screen. And now it changes to the green startup screen. As you can see, I've got an Acer monitor, and there's my cat screen starting up. So we'll see how long it takes to actually to boot up. And in the second part of the video that I'm going to put up, you will see my new laptop that I just got. I use not 32 antivirus. I'm not sure if you can Monday, hear it, but I have a December, clock. It's called eight, Save Your eight, Time. One. And it announces the all hours, and you can tell that it's 1.14 p.m. right now as I'm rebooting the computer. So I've got Nod32 starting up right here, and I've got my icons that are starting to gather down there. We've got the weather network, and right now in St. Catharines, Canada, it's minus 3 degrees Celsius and partly cloudy. It's supposed to rain, actually, tomorrow, and maybe on Wednesday and then get really cold again. So that disappears. We still have my Nod32, which is a good antivirus. And then we got my MSN Messenger starting up. And we can click like as if we're going to sign into it which actually makes it appear offline so people don't know I'm online, which I use sometimes when I'm using Messenger. And the bar, bar pops up. So, we don't want to go online at the moment. And then, 
Cut my arm, the messenger, which I just changed the skin to on this computer, and it's a black skin. No, I'll wait just for a minute, and it should start up. Then my Yahoo Messenger start up. Now this computer is ready to go. So that is my Windows XP computer. Like I said, I just purchased this uh, Windows Vista computer last uh, Thursday at a local store here in St. Catharines, and I'm just showing you, going to show you how fast this laptop, it's a Toshiba L300, how fast it shuts down. So we've got it so that it's at the owner setting and live setting. So I take what I'm going to do with it is at the moment I don't have my mouse attached. So I'm going to try and scroll over towards the bottom. I'm fairly, I'm not used to using the touchpad. So it sometimes takes a while. So we'll do it there and then we'll press that. And it says of course that it's shutting down. And then we got a blank screen. You can see my reflection in the window. Okay, now it shut down really quick. Now it's time to start it up again. So I press the power button. And we got the Toshiba Leading Innovation screen. We'll zoom it back out a little bit so that you can see more of it. And then Microsoft Corporation and the scroll bar that goes across. I have to wait a couple of minutes and it should start up. I like this stuff. I'm getting used to Vista. It does have its advantages and it does have its disadvantages. We just got a screen with a little cursor going on and now you can see the Windows logo right here and it says please wait. And then it says Windows Vista Home Premium right at the bottom here that you can see. And then we're back to the owner's screen again like we were when we started out. So as you can see my new computer here that I got boots up a lot quicker than XP. Just wanted to do this as an experiment to, um, you know, as an experiment. What happens automatically if you don't press owner is it starts up. And on this computer here, I've got my Windows Live Messenger, which is already opened up. It shows the clock and it shows, I've got the weather network for St. Catharines in a different format on this computer. Also, my Yahoo Messenger is on this computer, so as you can see, I still am looking right here, and I got it signed out of my XP computer, and it's just signed into my Vista laptop right here. So this is just a test to show the difference between my two computers and how fast they boot up and how fast they shut down, so I hope you've enjoyed this video. Have a good day, everyone.